Okay, hello everybody. Radio laws. Oh. Hello everybody, this is Fumes. The only thing I know is that I'm in a car. This can't be. Okay. Oh no. So, a little quick explanation of what this is. This is a, as you can see, a wave game. Where I must defeat the enemies. And it's very reminiscent of Twisted Metal. map in which I'm in an arena and I have to fight other enemy cars. I seem to only have Well, this is left than after all. God, if this game boots me back to the desktop after I die. Okay, somehow I won. There is crazy egg. actual history. I mean, I don't know. There are so many guys here that I don't know who's an ally. If there is an ally, actually. He's gonna shoot at the boss.
Your doom shall come. Enough of this. You are scrapped. Uh... Oh god, I can't see. I'm dead. Yes, the boss is shotting. Shotting? Shooting me. Uh... By the way, the name of this game is Fumes. Where am I going? Oh. Wait. Oh, I'm starting as this guy now? Oh, that, that's interesting. Ooh. Ooh, it's really interesting. Uh, uh, tracks on the radar, then we can talk. Face the flash. This? This way? Oh, my gun was gone. Huh. So there's an overworld mechanic to this game? No, I hate that. Uh, that thing? Yes, yes it is. Do I need to climb inside? We got a fresh chassis. Let's not see what they're calling. Uh -huh. Seven hundred bunker. There is no light in all this. There, then our chunk wheelers can be figured out or anything. So this way? Wait, does my weapon? Yeah. Yeah, it retracts. Again, the same wall. The same little wall. Okay, that's explosive. An explosive cardboard box. Mm. Yeah, see? The weapon retected. The, the weapon went back. You are scrap. Okay. What? Who? When? Okay. Ways to go. But it is. Last way. The fuel state. Divide. What is this now? Junk code. Is that a so? Why is there more boxes? And they are all just after me. Okay, uh, uh, I need a rock. Die again because I can't. Because I suck at this. How how can I get space? Killing the the ads does nothing besides reduce the number of shots I take. See, I died. What is gonna happen? No, no, no! Don't do this bullshit again. Are you serious? Do I have to just keep.
I'm gonna do this everything again. This time I'm on Canada. Is that a tiny house? Well, it is a tiny house. Wow. I'm curious, do I climb this? No. I actually got hurt by doing that. Of course they're behind me. This is the worst gun that I have ever seen. I don't care if it has damage because I don't. It has a very. It is so slow. Rust to rust. That it be, boy. Okay. Last blade. Such ferocity. Again. Junk toad. Fine. And everything is behind me, of course. Okay, I have a rock here. I have the worst gun that I have ever seen. I wonder. God, the, the beast gun sucks. I don't feel like I'm damaging anyone. Is he even taking damage with all the explosions going on around him? Oh! Well, I guess that's that. I just ran over another house! Don't fucking run off into the distance. We beat them, we collected some junk for you, it will be safe on our wheels, pick it up anytime you want. You know where to find us. Auto shop. Uh, sure. Auto MK1. Okay. Okay. Huh. So I need to find that truck then. Uh, let's meet and bring some shine to that rock. He's a dead away. He went dead away. Oh, I need... What is this? Scrap loading inventory, loading manager. Bodies. Wall. Suspension. Rubber. Okay. Weapon. Uh-huh, wait. Rotatory auto. More than okay. Barrels fire short projectiles with good motor velocity and higher rates. Good as a starter. Heavy machines deliver the reliable punch with good accuracy. Okay, let's go with that. Okay. Uh huh. 
Ooh. Make me make me bright pink. That way they will know that I'm coming. And they will fear me. Now that you got warm mountains and bring more, there's a little bit of an can cause right through passenger. Are you gonna give me back the control? Okay, so the green dot is the truck. This red dot, what is this? Is that an outhouse? It is. Okay, I need to do this. What the fuck? The hell? Jesus, everything is made out of paper mache. Paper mache, mache paper? What was the name of this? The arts crafts thing. Eat rust. Yes, eat myself. Even though I'm not that delicious. Ah. I know I should be doing more commenting on this, but it's actually pretty fun. It's not that bad. But I was I will have to say just ah. die already. Okay, as I was saying, I have to say, I'm surprised that there is a progression system in this game. I was completely expecting it to be just a deathmatch with randomly generated things. Wasn't expecting it to customize my car. Why is it always this many? I didn't even catch the name of this guy. What was it? Other boy? before I kill this. Okay. Did I get anything from that? Yes, I did. I got the Satine body. Okay. More suspension? Monster car. Can. Shotgun. Got the Kachuya. Fourth high volume of small sized rockets. Huh. Interesting. Rockets, you say. Okay, let's. Find that truck so I can customize myself and see this. Oh my god, there's. Okay. Bodies. Is that key? Weapons. Aha, I do have this one. Okay. Shotgun Katsuya. Yeah, don't try the Katsuya. Can I? Designed for perfectly young targets. Okay, wait a minute. I'll try the Kashuya. 
pretty interesting. This game got more going on than I was expecting. Hey, there's... What is all of this? Let's see what, where this goes. I wonder. If I walk through the mile, will they try and kill me? Oh, it's little... What the fuck? I'm killing you. Goodbye. Huh. Even the soundtrack is not that bad, too. Hey. Customization truck. I wonder if this game has a end game kind of deal, like a final boss or something like that. Would be really interesting to know. Too late to run. Three waves remaining. Oh my god, I can see them already. Okay. That wasn't so hard. Can't wait for the boss of this. It's way more easy to just do this. Stay still. And then shoot them. Wow. They are flying over there. Now is the boss. And his name is... Orwick. I am, am I ready to defeat the mighty Orwick? Okay, so he has rocket launchers. I imagine that that's gonna be a pain in the ass to deal with. Or not. Who's gonna die first, boy? Wow, that was fast. Let's see what I got. Pulling this body. Froggers. I, it's the third time that I got this. Katsuya. Rover. Pulling the suspension. Huh. Rocket launcher. Auto cannon. Off road ball and suspension. Okay. Okay, we can try some of that. Let's see how hideous I can work. Okay, let's try the falling his body. Uh suspension. Off road. Rover. Let's try off road. Let's see, weapons. Yes! Huh. What is with the different symbols? Let's try this out. How does this work? Okay. Oh, both are tied. To the main to the main shot thing. It's already feels very fun. Oh I didn't notice. 
can you look at my uh, my aim thing? You can actually track the aim of each gun when I turn like this. Ooh. That's very neat. I'm pretty sure that whoever made this game didn't have to do that. But they just did. Really cool, really cool. The only thing so far that I got a gripe with is the fact that there wasn't any menu or anything for me to just jump back into. Let's do one more of these and then we're all okay. The boogies. One, two, three. He has chainsaws. I need the chainsaws. Wow, that's a lot of waves. Come on. Big money. By the way, it has not been lost in me the Mad Max jokes that I could be doing right now. And the thing about that is that I didn't I don't actually really like Mad Max. The only movie that I did watch of the Mad Max series was the Fury Road one. And the beginning of that movie makes me hate the universe that Mad Max is set in. I still like a lot of the choreography and the cinematography of the movie itself. But I just feel like Mad Max is a stupid universe. But hey, people like stupid shit and no one says anything about it. So I don't have any say in that. So yeah. Don't expect me to make a joke like witness me. Or something like that. I wonder if I'm talking way too loud or way too, too low. Too quiet. But I'm gonna. I'm about to destroy Hate Rider. Or Hate Rider is about to destroy me. Or so he thought. The game's really fun, the game's really fun. Tartarus body. Interesting. So yeah. What I'm, I'm not sure if it was too loud, but what I'm trying to say about the Mad Max thing is that the beginning of Fury's Road makes it seem like that whole world that the, the movie that takes place was like actual society but then in the span of a few years it became a fucking desert and <laughs> I find that very silly that's that that's just the whole thing about the Mad Max and Waterworld god I don't I remember that I saw the trailer for Waterworld on Netflix and I watched it there thinking, oh, this might be interesting. It was such a nonsense movie. It's so weird. Like, not bad, but also not great. Maybe it's my lizard brain that can't really accept the logic of the movie. I guess people just have things like that where they can't really work the uh, like a thing that's just, hey, shut up your brain and enjoy it. But then your brain goes like, no, I refuse. This is too stupid. Hello, if you're seeing this, that means that was not the ending of the video. We're now going to venture into Rust Bucket Revenge, 
No, it's not my revenge. I am getting revenge upon by this car. Let's just look back at the controls real quick. What's the ship run that? M, mute. Why would I do this? Oh my god. Oh, it's back. Oh no. Oh my god. I died. I died again. I died again. I can't. <laughs> so silly. I played this for like 10 minutes before, and it's just this. It's just this. You have to avoid this car. The thing is, he moves so much faster than you that you really can't get a, a running start. So all I did in, this ten, in those 10 minutes that I played before was like play around in this little area. See? I also really enjoy it because it seems like, uh, okay, <laughs> as I was saying, it seems that uh, he gets damaged. But, uh, yeah, I, I don't know if there's like an end game to this. Oh, he's gonna kill me now. Oh, is he gonna? Let's try this thing. Yeah, so that's the problem. I'm pretty sure there isn't anything in here that can help me destroy this thing. Now I'm dead because I'm pretty sure the gas box. Huh? There was an ending to this game? Let me try this again. Okay, maybe I can actually defeat this thing. Yeah, I can't, I can't really run, dash, why am I a fucking geriatric child in this? Yeah, I think that's the most that I'm going to ever get close to it. But yeah, this is Rust Bucket Revenge. I'm surprised there's actually an ending. But the way the character you move in this game really sucks. It's like, it's so counterintuitive to this. I'm pretty sure the back of the car is also has a hitbox. Do this. What am I going to do this now? Seriously? Huh. Well, I guess that was Rust Bucket Revenge. 
the only way it seems to me to achieve the ruin of the man seems to be sacrifice myself to get more time on the clock. Let me see. Yeah, it, yeah, the car has a hitbox on the back of the as well. But hey, that was Rust Bucket Revenge. I hope you enjoyed both the games that I taped into this video. And I'll be leaving a link to both of them on the description down below. If you enjoyed it, leave a like. And I'll be seeing you guys again on the next video. Bye bye!